In this video, I'm going to show you everything you need to know to make automated time messages like these using StreamerBot. First of all, you want to make sure you've updated your StreamerBot to the most recent version. Now, a couple of weeks ago, they released 2.0, which is a massive update and has some really big changes in it. You want to make sure you're running that version, so I've put a link to that in the description box below. Go check it out. So what we want to do is we want to set up some triggers that will activate the messages on a timed basis. So if we head over to settings and then go to timed actions and then right click, add, this will bring a pop-up box so we can create the timed actions. So I'm going to create my first one and it's going to be called every 15 minutes, which is 900 seconds. It's in seconds. So if we do 900, that's 15 minutes. Make sure it's enabled. Make sure it's set to repeat. Press OK. So if we right click add, I'm then going to do every 10 minutes, which is 600 seconds. Press OK. Right click add every 5 minutes which is 300 seconds and press OK. Now there's your three different time settings, 15, 10 and 5. They're the three that I'm going to use the most. So they're the three that I've set up. You can set up as many or as few as you want. So the next step is we need to create some actions that these triggers will work with. So if we go over to actions, right click and add. Now I'm going to create one here called bot message discord. So this is going to be my discord message. I'm going to create a new group called bot messages just to keep everything tidy go over make sure it's enabled and go down and always run and then press ok so that you can see you've got the bot messages group which will keep them all together and then you've got the bot message from a discord so if we head over to sub actions right click we're going to want to go all the way down to youtube and send message to channel now you've got two options at the top here, a new drop down box. So you've got the bot message, which is set from a bot account if you set one up. Or if you go down, you can go onto the broadcaster, which is your account. So that would come from you. So it would say your name in the chat. So I'm going to choose that one today because I want it to come from me. And I'm going to post a little message in here. Why not join the Discord server with a link to my Discord server? And then I'm going to go across and OK that. Now we need to set the trigger up. So the triggers are the ones that we set up earlier, the 15, 10 and 5 minute ones. So if we right click and we go down to core and across and down to timed actions, you'll see a drop down box with all the ones you've already made. So you can see there we've got the 15, the 10 and the 5 minute one. And for this, I'm going to choose 15 minutes because I want it to post every 15. So if we click OK, and there you can see we've got a Discord message from the bot that will post why not join the Discord server every 15 minutes in the chat. Next, what we need to do is we go over here and right click and we duplicate the one that we've just done. So if we double click on it, we can change the name. So this one, I'm going to delete that and I'm going to put like and sub. So this one's going to tell people to like and sub, make sure it's enabled, make sure it's in the bot messages group and it always runs. Click OK and then I need to change the message. So if I click on it, delete that it's going to be from my broadcaster account don't forget to like and subscribe there we go and then go down press ok and that'll post every 15 minutes also now if we go back across and i right click and duplicate again Double click and then change this here because I want it to be something different and I want it to be my epic code. So it's going to display my epic code, make sure it's enabled, it's in the bot message group and it always runs. I'm going to change it to please use epic code terrible gamer in the item shop. There we go press OK. But I don't want that every 15 minutes. If I click up here, I can then go and change this to, I think, every five minutes and then press OK. And there you have it. Three messages that will automatically be posted into your chat for you. Two every 15 minutes and one every five minutes. Now let's go over to live chat and test them out. So the first one should be any second now. There we go. Now I've set these to five, 10 and 15 seconds purely for the video. So the next one should come along. There's the second one, and there's the third one. 
So as I say, you can do them for 5, 10 and 15 minutes. I've just done these in seconds to make it easy for the video. Now, if you don't want them spamming the chat, there is another feature that we can also use. Now, you'll notice when we go back in here that you can actually see there's a line section as well. So that will post every time there is X amount of lines. So what we do is we click on the timed action we want to go into. We will leave it at 900 seconds and then we put in how many lines we want it to have first. So there we go. It's going to activate after 10 lines or 900 seconds and both need to be active at the same time. You can see there, I've set that argument there for 10 lines, the rest are set for zero. There you have it. Everything you need to know to make automated time messages for your live stream using Streamerbot. Now before you go, please do consider hitting that like button and I'll see you in the next video.